everybody welcome to the second episode of the checked out podcast last time we talked about men's drama episode and me being a liar and that got 40 downloads so thanks for watching this time we're gonna try to talk about fast food doing a tier list hell yeah hell yeah hell yeah <laughs> hell yeah all right so we got a couple of uh fast foods on our list today i think maybe 15 20 19 i'm pretty sure so 15 in total so pretty much we're gonna go through them have our hot takes about them and see what we think you know and you could join along too maybe we'll put like a tier list a, a list of all the foods in the description and you could just uh you could play along with us all right so <laughs> first off let's start with wendy's what do you guys think about wendy's s tier what? Yo, I have yeah. that. I have that in the D tier, bro. D <laughs> Hold up, oh, what D tier? <laughs> I put I put an A. It's I put an A. It's alright. It's pretty good. Yeah. I put in B. It's okay. Yo, I've only had yeah, the uh, the uh, what what you call the ice the cream thing? The, the frosty. The frosty. I had that and it tasted disgusting. <laughs> and I was like, that's the only thing I've ever had with Wendy's, and it was a bad impression. I I had to put it in D tier. That's fair enough. I haven't ever. That's fair enough. Their yeah. their their frosties aren't the best. Like out of like fast food, like ice cream, they're they're pretty they're pretty much the worst when it comes to that. But their food yeah. in general, I like it. I like it. They're spicy. Yeah, I, I might have to have the food, but I've never had anything yeah. else. Wait, so Nathan thinks it's S tier? That's my personal favorite. That's my personal favorite tier. I don't know. Really? I don't know. Hey, why <laughs> is it S tier? Whoa. The nostalgia. Because of the spicy chicken nuggets. Those aren't That's even that good, why. though. That's not they're even pretty good. They're the best. They're the best nuggets. <laughs> no, you don't know, Ryan. You, no. I think they're the go best back nuggets again. fast food offers. Maybe I got a bad batch. Who knows? No, no, yeah, no, 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 they are. No, 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 Lars, spicy nuggets. Lars, are you American? Lars, do you have taste buds? I mean, I mean, <laughs> okay, what's... Man, it's a nugget though. It's you not like a that. tender, right? Like, like when you're having a tender, that's like chicken, right? That's like a actual piece of meat, you know? That's in its own category. We got to set, we got to separate also... nuggets from, chicken. from uh, tenders and stuff. And I think Wendy's nuggets, you know, they're uh, they're up there. I mean. Something else in the list is so much better, but I'll wait for us to get there and then I'll point it out. But my God, I can't believe you're you can't say I that. I think that's the one thing though. Nuggets, man. You can't even speak I, to it. I huh? think the nugget sauce is really good from Wendy's. Hmm. I forgot what sauce it was. It's pretty good. I got some all right sauces there. Yeah. I think it's I'd okay. Say though. Yeah. It's not yeah, like. But I mean, I'm, I'll I'm go out. It. Oh. Sorry, Ben. You can go. No, no, you go ahead. Okay. Yeah, I was just gonna say if I'm craving it, I'm not. If I'm ever craving it, then it's like then I'm not gonna like. If it's like super far away, I'm not gonna go out on my way to get it. I like some other options. It's just like oh, it's, if it's around the corner, I might get it. Yeah, it's not something you seek out. You know, you get how no, it's it definitely it's like, something well, you seek out. <laughs> spicy nuggets. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Out spicy of nuggets. all other man, oh, no. that's the Lars, only reason. Why. Lars and but Nathan. I will say. Lars and Nathan I did right kind of now. bump it down a ring. I would have put it, because, like, I really like the nuggets, but let me see where I put it. Yeah, I put it in A, but I, I've never had their burgers on the menu and stuff. Yeah. You ever had the burgers? Nah. From when? Okay, you can't, you can't That's put something thing. in like, A I, tier I don't, when we have the chicken had, nuggets. Like, you never fresh, had never it? frozen That's beef. the one thing they have there. Like, that's the way it's you go for Wendy's. I can't no, burgers. I don't know. <laughs> exactly. The nuggets are good. So you, oh, so you only have the nuggets? Is that they're that good. Okay, you listen. Have. Whenever I go to Wendy's, right, I could get their burgers. But why would I go and get their burgers when I can get their nuggets? The nuggets are that good. But like that's like a what? <laughs> that's that like a side thing. You, you get that? Yeah, I don't understand the, with the, the burger. <laughs> you get nuggets with the burger. Yeah. You don't just go to a fast food just yeah, to get nuggets. Nuggets are nuggets. a side. Nah, I, I I go there to yeah, get nuggets. Yeah, exactly. What do you just get? Like how many nuggets do you get at once? Twenty. <laughs> the twenty piece nuggets. Yeah. That's the thing. You guys don't okay, do that. that. No. I guess, I mean, like, it'd why be, is there literally would, a 20 piece like, replace meal the fries if, if you wanted to get nuggets? It'd replace the fries. Nah. Pretty much. I get fries yeah. too sometimes. <laughs> with my nuggets. 
you get nuggets and fries. I'm, I'm with Lars on this. There's literally a 20 piece meal just for this. Like, it's a normal thing people yeah, do. Yeah, but how many good. people actually get that? How many people what? How many people actually like just get chicken nuggets from a fast food? A lot know? of people. Right, especially lot of down in the Wendy's comments is... below. Do you get nuggets alone or only as a side for the burger? Oh, God. <laughs> I, mean, yeah. I used to do that when I was a kid. But then you know, as I grew older, I got hang hungrier. So I want a burger with my nuggets. Yeah, like, That's would you I rather think. have like nuggets or a full burger? Nuggets. You know? Exactly. It's just like. Yeah, no. nuggets. <laughs> if the nuggets I mean, are good, I'd rather have the nuggets. I get both. Depends. I still can't believe yeah, that but, you have okay, I've never the, had the okay, nuggets. Okay, the thing for me is. So I can't Like, burgers for me, they're like mid. They're not even like my favorite food. Yeah, I can, I can agree with that. I don't like burgers. Like, I don't like burgers, but like, like David said, I'll have them if yeah. they're there. Mm -hmm. But like nuggets, I mean, I why don't you just like make some like chicken at home or something then, <laughs> then get chicken nuggets. Because the Wendy's nuggets are good, <laughs> like, man. I'm... The spicy. Why don't you just you make a burger at home instead of like, get at Wendy's? Can't recreate the feeling. It's the same thing. Wendy's burgers. Well, I don't get dry. burgers at Wendy's. I don't think that. Anyways. <laughs> All right. <laughs> let's move on to the next <laughs> one. What's the next that was one? a good one. That was a good one. All right. Let's get a Taco Bell. Let's hear about this one. Oh, I got some about? opinions oh, on this. D tier, bro. D tier. D tier. What? Me and Nathan Wait just went there. D tier for diarrhea. No. Diarrhea. Oh, listen, the shit it's you don't go to sure. you don't I go to fast food restaurants to get sure. good poops, David. They'll all give you diarrhea. Yeah. <laughs> no, Taco Bell is particularly bad. No. What about it? It just gives me diarrhea. I guess. The only reason it's not an F tier. The only reason I didn't put in F tier is just because uh, one of their drinks. I forgot what it was. Hot the the blue drink. Hot blast. Yeah, wow. that one or whatever. That's a good drink. That's the only reason it's not an F tier. But like the tacos themselves, they're so trash. I don't, I don't go there for the tacos. Like they're disgusting. floppy. You don't like the Doritos Locos tacos, man? No, there's they're okay. That just tastes weird. I don't like the. I don't like. Why would you make a taco shell out of Doritos? What? It tastes, like, it tastes good. Though. It tastes better. Okay, I don't like Doritos particularly, so uh, that might be the reason. But like, come on, I'd rather just have like that. And their taco shells are so like soft. I hate soft taco shells. I just tried their like Crunchwrap, Crunch, Crunchwrap Supreme not too long ago. That shit hit. That was so good. But I did move Taco Bell down to a B after consideration. It was an A. Yeah, you had it just because a? it's like it's it pretty, uh, <laughs> it's pretty good. I feel like, but I don't think it's that good anymore. It's it's a B. Yeah, anymore. anymore. I I would have I would have put it in A, but I moved it down to D recently, because <laughs> then in like 2020 they got rid of their potato products, and after that it sucked ass. And then they brought them back, but it's just it's just never been the same. It's never oh, been really? the same. Like before, when they had like the like the potato loaded grillers. The Fritos burritos and stuff that was like a dollar. It was so it was such a good deal and it was so good. But now it sucks ass. <laughs> now <laughs> now I hate it. It's just like I can't eat any of it. Yeah, it's, I, it's definitely yeah, a D. Sucks. Now what is okay? I'd say it's a mid. I'd say it's like it's definitely so mid. like a C B. Like it does its purpose. Like low as mid a, or high mid. I'd say it's a B for me because it does its purpose it's as like a fast food place. You know, you're not going there for a gourmet meal. You know, but it's not like well, you don't shitty. go to any fast you know, food restaurant like... for a gourmet meal. It's a fast yeah, food restaurant. Like, I know, but like <laughs> to be fair though, it's like Taco a Bell is better than like Taco Taco Del Mar or, or like Taco Town. Okay. Like okay, that, yeah, that's hard. It's like hard <laughs> to be Tan worse than that though. Taco Town <laughs> those were on there. <laughs> I don't know about that one. Like I'd rather have Taco Bell than the other taco joints. Those, those, like, those are good. Okay. The taquitos are ice. What's the next one? All right. <laughs> Let's move on. Let's move on. All right. Oh, next one we got Subway. 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 B tier. I have it in B tier. I said C. I said, I said C. C. Okay. C. It was an yeah, A C. for me, but I went today and it moved down to a B. So here's what happened, okay? Oh, man. <laughs> I went to go get the Subway. I walk in. You know how there's like two different sizes, right? There's the six inch and then there's the yeah. foot long. Yeah. Now they got three. 
They got three. What? Did I just yeah, they got like the one. So <laughs> no, 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 no. So, <laughs> they got a six inch. They got a foot long, and then they got like extra meat now. But then the problem is now that they're all like way higher priced than they would normally be. Like Ow, I went in, hell. a six the inch adjustment. was like seven, eight bucks. That used to be what a foot long oh. cost, you know. But now <laughs> a foot long costs foot like long. ten bucks. No, it's not. That's way in the past. Now it's like a ten dollar foot long or like eleven dollars, where I could just go Yo, somewhere I better. Know that. Like, I could go eat pizza instead of this really small sum. Exactly. So pizza such a different like food. Than I haven't had sandwich though. Like, it's the comparison like between the, but like you're comparing pizza to the fucking subway. Yeah. Two completely okay. Things. Yeah, Subway, pizza's on another level. Subway used to be an S tier for me. All right, S. I used to love. Really? Subway. Wow. I, I used to love Subway. Wow. Yeah, no. because they had That's really good pieces. Nice when I worked there, it helped me appreciate it more. You know, I liked it a lot more. But now with the new like I mean, new things they implemented, it's just it's so bad. But today, yeah, no, it made me move it down to a B tier. I was very disappointed. You know, speaking yeah, of bad deals really. with Subway, you guys hear about, like, people, I don't know what's still going on, but people were suing Subway over the fact that their footlongs are actually 10 inches. I think. Really? Really? Yeah, it's 10. Wow. <laughs> Yo, wow. people they're actually out tennis. here oh, grabbing shit. measuring tapes. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> That's much how intimidating Yo, that how is. Freaking, yeah, I just how, heard about it. I was like, damn. Yo, how Subway is scamming their people. Like, how petty do you have to be to... To sue a company over two inches. <laughs> just it I don't understand that. A lot of people be petty it's, over two inches, man. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a burger, it's a sandwich. Like, I mean, it's two oh, inches. Yes. Yeah, you're not getting the full man. value. Dude, two, two, two inches, inches two inches make a big difference when you're that's like, six when you're like of, four inches, right? That's over 10%. Inches, two inches. They're shaving off no, no, and no, no, charging no. me more money See, for <laughs> no, like a four inch and a six inch has a big difference, but like a ten inch and a twelve inch, that's not a big difference. It's got like, a big difference. like two inches, I don't. Oh my, like, I feel like ten inches is perfect. Like you get full from that. I can't imagine eating another two inches. <laughs> if. It, <laughs> 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 oh my god. <laughs> I'm just going to the clips channel over here. It's going to be taken out of Clip context that. for sure. Clip Min saying 10 oh, inches man. is perfect. 10 inches? <laughs> yeah. We have Min <laughs> saying that on, inches, on recording now. <laughs> no. Two, uh, and then also two okay, inches is not, not enough. Let's, for Min. Let's not, not, not significant. Like, so don't have to Did that. they find two out inches. like uh, the tuna at Subway wasn't even tuna? Wasn't that a thing? Yeah, Subway has a lot of content. I don't know. I've been seeing drama about that. Yeah, I just know that they're the C. Who's the CEO they had? The weird guy. Oh, wasn't it like the Jared? Weird guy. About... Jared? Was he yeah, CEO? Jared. Yeah, yeah, the Jared's boy. Wait, don't, don't I thought he was the, just boy, the guy right? in the commercials. <laughs> your boy. Okay. <laughs> okay. Your well, boy. maybe not the boy. Well, yeah, was your boy? Your boy? Yeah. No, okay. Come on. No, not the boy. <laughs> Definitely not the 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 used to be boy. Well, okay, wait. No, that yeah, that sounds dude, worse. You, <laughs> you had freaking child pornography. The dude's, oh, a, the level dude's stuff. a pedophile, bro. He's having sex with minors. Oh, oh he went up. Oh. <laughs> oh. God, oh. never mind. Okay, so, uh, okay, so uh, next, next, yeah, next, next one. Next one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next, next we're going on to Sonics. Ooh. I put that in D tier. I've never had. Me, me too. I put it in D. Really? I've never had it, so I just put it in the never had. Yeah, I put it in yeah, D tier so, also. Yeah. I think Sonics is just not good. It. It's, I, Wait, is it actually no? Not yeah, good? I feel like it's really no. overhyped. It's, like I think the yeah, like I said, you're high. The only good parts like the driving and the aesthetic of like Sonic, because like they come in on like really? roller I skates like sometimes, you know, and it's like wow, they're on roller skates, you know, the food must be oh. good, right? And then you eat it and it's shit. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's, I feel like places with a gimmick like that are not are not yeah. good. Like. They have a gimmick just to cover up some bad parts of their food. Like, the experience makes up for the meal, in a way. No, but, like, I think that's the only reason. It gets so bad. Like, you see videos on YouTube of, like, these people on roller skates delivering <laughs> yeah. food. Like, throwing the food on the window. <laughs> <laughs> and then it just all... It fucking just on the window. <laughs> it's uh, so funny. 
It's just like, man. Yeah, but I've never had it, so I can't yeah. say anything Definitely about a it. D for me. It's a D. Yeah, well, I would have for put an F, but I think their milkshakes are pretty good. But other than that, mm. like, pretty much everything else I've had on the menu just, like, really mediocre. Mm -hmm. I was, it really I, just sucks. I looked up their menu, and it was, like, the first image result was a picture of their burger. And that just, like, solidified the D tier for me. Because <laughs> yeah. it just looks so <laughs> sad. <laughs> Yeah, every th their portions are very small too for you pay. Yeah. Like you don't get much. Oh, for that's you pay a deal for. breaker. Hmm. Anyway. All right, okay. next one. Let's hit it. Okay, Popeyes. I it. A tier. I so got it in A tier. tier, all the way up in A tier. Mm. I've never actually had that's Popeyes good, before, man. so I don't have a take on this one. Yo, like Popeyes, mm -hmm. no cap, best chicken joint. I've had so far. I agree. Out of no like, cap. All the, it's pretty good. I agree. No cap. With the it's, sauce, it's, the it's sweet the best sauce chicken. on their burgers. Yeah, the chicken burger was phenomenal. Very good. Stupendous. Yo, I even just so. their the like the their their chicken legs and stuff. They're so and their I think it's their fries. I forgot. I don't know if they're oh, Cajun, Cajun or not. Fries. Yeah. So, oh, yo, those are next level. Yeah, they got like a lot of good stuff uh, there. Yeah, I just, it's not S tier for me because I don't like their tenders. Their tenders are always too dry for me. I just can't tell it's if I'm going at the wrong times or what, but. I love, I love good. Tenders. I just don't like the lines. Popeye's lines, like, they're so long, or at least the ones near my place. Like, you have to wait 30 minutes to get your, like, uh, meal, which sucks. Oh, at Evergreen? Or whatever. Yeah, especially there. Hmm. I but, take, like, uh, you have to do online orders. That's the only way you get it on time. But the one by me is just Ooh. like empty all the time. You like you can just drive really? up the, up right to the window pretty much most of the time. Yeah. Man, I guess I gotta go. Wait, you 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 live all, you live like twenty five minutes away though. Yeah, no, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah it's, it's something not as populated as where you live, so. Yeah, it was in the middle. Of I remember it was like super <laughs> yeah, hyped much. though. The Popeyes yeah. chicken sandwich. Oh, that is like, actually good though. That is yo, really good. That's my favorite thing there. The there was like a trend on Popeye's Chicken Sandwich. That's all I've had. See, I'd rather good. get their like their like four piece meal, more so than like the sandwich. But the, their sandwich is good. The chicken, the it's chicken like, chicken's so like good. this fucking big. It's insane. Yeah, the chicken plate yeah. is so, so good. good. So good. So <laughs> good. just Dude, slap Popeye's a chicken in there. Level. A whole ass chicken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they do. Yeah, pretty much. It's a massive chicken. It's so Dude. big. Damn. Dude. Okay. What's next? Speaking of big. Let's go to the next one. Panda Express, a big food chain. I put that in B. D tier. I said D tier, bro. I, I said D. I said D. I said D. What? C tier. D -tier. Yeah, I said D. Yo. Not, not a big How fan. How dare they culturally I said B. My culture. I, yo, the only relatively good thing is the uh, orange chicken, and that's just mediocre at best. It's, no, okay, the orange chicken that's slaps, true. though. It's pretty yeah, good. but it's mediocre at best. If you've had good orange chicken, bro, it's it's it sucks. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. It is still uh, pretty good though. Yeah. yeah, I'm not saying it's like bad, bad. It's just mediocre compared to. It's a, crazy the though. Good stuff. You go to my college, right? And then like you see a massive line at Panda, and then like no one at Subway. And then I'm just like, it's not that. Well, good. portions. I think Panda has like good portions. Yeah, yeah. that's true. I think it's, it's also nice. cheaper. I'll in give Subway that. Now, right? And the, for yeah. what you get Porsche. in the price, it, it's a pretty good deal. Yeah, I, I'll say that. Yeah, and you get fortune cookies. cookies. Yeah. Yeah. Don't you guys want to know your fortune? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I bumps it up a letter. I don't know. I don't understand why, but I love the taste of fortune cookies. Like I, I will, I, I love going to like Chinese places just for the fortune cookies. I'm not a big fan of Chinese food, but I like fortune cookies better than Chinese food. <laughs> so just order a platter of fortune cookies. <laughs> Wait, I wish yo. I could do that. Did you guys ever do that thing where you like get the fortune like out of the cookie? It's one that you really like, so you put it in your shoe, so it like come true. What? No, I put it like, I I no. Put it in, like my wallet one time, but no, it's just like, like oh my god, I... you will have a nice day tomorrow, and I'm like, I want to have a nice day tomorrow, <laughs> so you put it in your shoe, and then you like walk with it the whole day. And then, Who told you this wrong? I've never heard of it. I've I see it. people putting it in their I phone. I used to do that. I've heard, I've heard it somewhere shoe. before. I was like, and then I don't know if it came true. Maybe it was placebo, but I think I had a good day, 
So, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> the next day. Yeah, that's what you always do. It's like, uh, <laughs> like those uh, things people tell you, like those myths or legends. I've never heard of that one. I heard, I heard I one where like if you either. take the the fortune out without breaking the cookie, then it will come true. But you know, fortunes suck anyway. Yeah. So. I've heard, the only one I know is like you have to finish the cookie for the for the fortune to come true. Yeah, but who doesn't weird. finish the cookie? It's it's, it's like a one bite thing, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, like yeah. How do you not finish it. <laughs> I've only heard my uh, sister like eats it in like four pieces. Just, like nibble on it <laughs> until it's gone. Like, it's so weird. I don't trust people like that. <laughs> Wait, you guys don't do that? Like I break, <laughs> I do do that. You nibble on it, like you nibble on it. <laughs> nibble on your fortune cookies like a mouse? No, no, no. Like you crack it in half and then I like, cut the individual pieces off. No. So there's like six pieces total, and then I like. No, I just like I break it in half and I'll just take one big bite. Yeah, big chunk. Like I, I like, I break it off. I break it off any I just Don't stick the whole thing in my mouth. What the heck? <laughs> Never done that before. <laughs> I just take a big chomp out of my uh, fortune cookie. Yeah. Yeah. They're small enough to fit in your mouth. Yeah, but they're such a weird shape. I don't like chewing on them. I, I like <sighs> breaking them and eating like the small pieces. Okay, that just might be weird. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's Wait, Elisha does that. <laughs> I think Elisha does that. Breaks down. Elisha, Elisha rips up all his food, yeah. though. I only only do it with fortune cookies just because I don't like the shape of them. They're just so weird. Hmm. Huh. Have you guys, like, uh... What's next? Oh. oh. I said I've seen, like, someone Wait, no, no. use uh, chopsticks for fortune cookies one time. No. Like, I seriously? Know, you just take the paper out anyways. I don't think I've seen like, that. No, because, like, people, chopsticks? like, they're too lazy. They've been, like, using their, like, uh, chopsticks the whole time. They're eating, right? So they're just, like, they're too lazy to just use their hand and eat it. So they just use the chopsticks and break it apart and, like, eat it like that. I've seen that. Would, that. I would require that. more effort, is it, don't you yeah, think? That would... Like, isn't it in like a little package too? So well, you have to use well, your hands to open it anyway. If you're like a pro at it though, like some people are like fucking professional chopsticks. How do they unwrap something? There's no way. There's no way. Okay. No, if you are like adept with chopsticks, like if you use them every day, you prefer. Like I prefer chopsticks. I can I can use chopsticks better than I can use. A yeah, fork. but like, like. I would, would you open the plastic wrapper like, of the rather... with chopsticks, or would you use your hands? Oh no, no, it's not the plastic yeah. wrapper. <laughs> no, I, I, oh. yeah, I thought it was just saying like the the cracker itself. Okay. Yeah, it's the cracker itself, not the plastic wrap. I feel like. It's I mean, like I would never do it. Yeah, but then, like, why would you open it? <laughs> I would. Then, like, I understand why. Like, put it down and then just like, okay, mm -hmm. now it's time for chopsticks. Okay. You know. <laughs> you just don't want to touch <laughs> it with your hands. That yeah. is true. Yeah, you have to set it up. Well, you don't want to touch right. your hands. Like, you just put it on the plane and you're like testing yourself. There's too many what ifs to this. <laughs> like you open it, then put it. You know what? I'm going to do that next time. <laughs> yeah, do I, it. I like where just, the picture. Just a, yeah. just a bunch of crumbs on the it. table. I kind of like where the... <laughs> he just crumbles apart. Just polarizes it. <laughs> Excuse me. Dude, that's how Nathan's oh, aggressive you. sneeze. <laughs> like, they can just die. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm good, I'm good. Okay, let's go on to the next okay. one. McDonald's. Oh, here's a crazy one. That's, okay. D tier. That one, that S. I put it A tier. D tier. D. Solid D. D, D tier. D oh, D shit, D we gotta hear this. Mine's a B tier. Mine's B. Mine's B Wait, as well. well. Let's hear Ryan's first. The fries are the only reason. Oh, yeah. I mean, okay, the fries are good. I think everything else sucks. Except for, like, the McGriddle. The but for the, the price, stuff. though. The like, McGriddle, like, the hash brown. That's pretty good. Everything else just sucks. Really? Like, if you compare them okay. to the, any any other fast yeah. food place, like their burgers, I've never had like a good experience with their burgers. Their fries are like they're okay. It's just like the classic kind of like fried taste. Their McFlurries are just like super basic and stuff. Like everything there is just like mediocre. Not I, I don't think it's that good, especially when you compare it to other restaurants. Really? I mean that's true. I put it in B. I only go to McDonald's for their fries. It's like, I will get their fries. I don't like their burgers at all, but like their fries, like raise it up to a B tier just because I'm a. I love fries, and I feel like McDonald's has the best fries out of most fast food chains, and I that just raises. That. Like I will go out of my way to get their fries, and I feel like that warrants a B tier. Yeah. 
the other fries are banging. Like that's why I that's put it saying. up there because everybody talks about McDonald's fries. It's like the fries you go to, it's you know. The, it's the classic nostalgic yeah. fry flavor that my mouth craves. Yo, yeah, they're so good. <laughs> Korea, that sounds a bit weird. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I feel like I, I really feel like, like every other place's steak. fries are better. I think they might be better, but for me, what makes McDonald's really good is it's pretty like affordable for its price, and you get like a lot of volume, you know. For like what you're paying. Does that make sense? Like, yeah, that's the other reason I put it so high because you can get like the most food for the ch- the lowest price yeah. there. I think. I mean, even though like plain cheeseburgers, like I I enjoy. Yeah, and like eating those. I think those are in good. my opinion, yeah. those things on the menu there are like they're they're good. They're not like they don't exceed any standards, I guess, but they don't like make me like I I don't dislike it. You know what I mean? I don't think there's many things on the yeah. menu I dislike. Wait, wait, wait. But like those special ones, you know, like the special sandwiches, I think those are like overpriced for what they are. Yeah, yeah. That's true. Yeah. I never get those. Like their yeah, new chicken I, sandwich. I think the most promotional pies. things are yeah. buffs. Yeah, any restaurant. The BTS meal? Yeah. Yeah. It's like $6. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's a BTS, <laughs> junk cook. <Jimmy. laughs> I got so pissed when I ordered Scotty. that. <laughs> I just wanted one sauce from the menu, or one sauce from that meal, and they didn't even give it to me. I was pissed. Wow, were they were they out or something? Maybe, probably. Yeah. What what even Wait, is so that? The, is it just yeah, nuggets the with meal like with the that sauce? Huh? Is that all it is? The spicy sauce. So, right? They they had like a creamy sriracha sauce, pretty much, or something, something like that. It was like a sriracha mayo, or it was Cajun. Yeah, it was Cajun, Cajun sauce. But it was just a, like a sriracha mayo. I felt like. Uh, and they had a sweet chili sauce, right? But McDonald's used to offer like the sweet chili sauce like a few years ago. That was my favorite sauce on the, in like the the nugget sauce roster, you know. But then they removed it. And that was like a dreadful day, you know. <laughs> Rock. <laughs> it was. <laughs> and then, and then I saw right. they brought it back for the BTS meal, and I got so excited that I had to get the meal, right, just to see if it was the same. And they didn't even give me the Don't fucking cook. sauce. I was pissed. <laughs> Sucks for you. Don't you love BTS though, Lars? Yeah, I love Jimin and Jungkook. Jungkook, yeah, it's Jungkook, my favorite. I heard Jungkook. people like. I love BTS. Hat, like, they don't give you the sauce if you don't get the meal. Like, yeah. I don't even know. Well, I mean, because that, that's all the meal so is. Dumb. It's just regular nuggets <laughs> with the sauce. Pretty much the sauce. Like, the sauce is the meal. Like, if you're. If you're out of Pain sauce, what is it? Is it just chicken yeah, nuggets? Yeah, that's what it is. Like, chicken nuggets and fries. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me feel like John Cook when I eat the meal. Mm. But okay. I think the price and convenience <laughs> brings it to an A for yeah, me. Yeah, like there's always a McDonald's within the mall. Really? Where you live usually. Yeah. They're always packed though. Like the line oh, is yeah, always true. ten miles that's long. That's true. Both of them. They have like two, like the two line system. They're both always packed. Every single time I go, even even really? the one really? out here. Even the one out here, where I live in the butt fuck nowhere, like it's always full. But, the line. The lines. Don't. The take one close really. to us doesn't really have that long of a line. Yeah. yeah. Usually. Mm-hmm. But they got the kioskes. Or what's it called? Kiosks. The kioskes. Yeah. Kiosk. Yeah. They got the kiosks. Kios. <laughs> the kioske. No, what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> 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 what the fuck? Yeah. So you <laughs> go in. <laughs> You know, you don't have to stand in a line. You can just go to the... Uh, you know what? Put a sock in it. We'll go to the next one. Okay. KFC. Okay, hit us. Oh, what boy. KFC? B tier. F, F, B tier. F, F, F. F. Fucking sucked my dick. F- really? B tier. sucks. Disgusting. Yo, that's B tier for me, bro. Terrible. B tier. It's a C tier for me. I can see C tier. So greasy. It's so yeah. fucking greasy. I'm never gonna go to KFC unless someone else like really wants to go there. Mm. I have to eat with them or something. Really? I mean, I, I I enjoy fried chicken. I like it more than burgers, so I rank it higher. But like, it's it's worse than Popeyes definitely. But I feel like it's better than a lot of the burger joints that I'm usually go to. Like I'd rather have like fried chicken than freaking um like Panda Express or something or Taco Bell. Like I'd rather have KFC than that. Yeah, there's just so many better options. Really? I feel like. Like fried mm. chicken, you know? Fried yeah. every other option yeah. is better than KFC, yeah. in my opinion. <laughs> Any other place? Make KFC. Every single time I go there, they fuck up my order somehow. I've been to one, I've been to, like everywhere. Like, 
different place around Washington. I went to one in Idaho. They still fucked up my orders. Somehow the chicken <laughs> is bland. Like they just don't. It, like it just. It just. I hate it. Yeah. It's like why would I go there when I can go to Popeyes where everything's good. I think. <laughs> like, Popeye. Oh, no. The Popeye, only time I've bro. gone out of my way for like KFC is because it's like I think their chicken is seasoned like differently than most places. You know, it's like there are like eleven spice thing or whatever. But like that's that's like once every like five years I swear, or something, probably less. Eleven spices and herbs. Yeah. And they say if they have eleven different spices, I taste none of them. <laughs> It tastes, <laughs> it tastes, it tastes like it's nothing. Yeah. It's I don't hear the suck. hot takes. <laughs> it's, huh. it's weird though. You ever go like when you go to Thailand, right? Everybody there's a KFC fiend. Oh, I think like fiend. you see KFCs as much as you see like McDonald's. I mean, their it's menu might be in different in over there, right? Yeah. yeah. It's, it's like, the same in Vietnam too. Everyone loves KFC. Yeah, it's so. It, weird. It's like it tastes different though. It tastes different in Vietnam than yeah. it does here. Yeah, no, it's definitely different, but like. I wonder why. I think it's better. I think it's just like fresher chicken. Fresher chicken in Asian countries. Anywhere Man, else. why do we have to have the shitty KFC? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, we got so many, so much other good food. I feel like. Maybe. Isn't yeah? KFC supposed Hell to yeah. be like like an American yeah, it's thing. Kentucky. But over here, it sucks ass. <laughs> That's true. It's better it in Asia than in his here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's wrong I think with it's that? Because, uh, like foreign countries have higher standards. We do not have higher standards in Vietnam. Really? Oh my god. <laughs> Dirt roads everywhere? No. I think it's just like, it's like, KFC is like a fancy restaurant in Vietnam though. Fancy? I think yeah. that's where you're going. Yeah, same for like uh, oh, Thailand. Uh, a that's like, that's like, that's like, that's like, bust out the fine <laughs> China. We're going to KFC sort of thing. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's like relatively more expensive than anything else around it. Like the street food isn't, doesn't cost as much as KFC. Like a big bowl of pho is literally four times less than a bucket of KFC. That's what I think. Hmm. I went to a KFC in Thailand and they had like uh, the chicken on like a rope hanging in front of the store. <laughs> so, <I> mean, <laughs> that's how you know it's fresh. Yeah. That's how you know it's like super fresh. So yeah. everybody in Thailand, like, they all have like fake, like, drip you know they have like fake supreme and like gucci but they also all wear like kfc shirts <laughs> so... that, is, that is weird huh? i don't know watch a different place over there yo Thanks, why man. would they wear fake stuff when they know that it's fake that's so stupid well no you don't know it's fake until like it's look cool. until you have to look really, okay like, i have a shirt that says off wheaty it's like an off-white <laughs> shirt but Wait like, for okay. Off White is the most overrated luxury brand out. Yeah, there. but it was five I'm bucks, like, man. Yeah, I think, <laughs> it was well, five still, bucks, <laughs> yeah. Didn't you? Okay, didn't you not the know? only Off White, the only Off White like apparel that looks good is the uh, the collab they did with Jordan, Jordan ones. But, oh, I would pay for those, but they're like three K for a pair of shoes. But dude, I mean, those shirts look, look good. good I don't sometimes. even watch. Like I just bought it. I mean, it's cool. literally just it's like a white shirt and it just says like shirt or something on it with Wait, no, that's Supreme. Marks. I'm th- I'm pretty sure, right? No no no. Off white's no. the one where it's just like quotation, quotation marks, marks. Oh. like <laughs> shoe <laughs> or like <laughs> basketball. Yeah, about the static <laughs> <thing>. like <laughs> bag. People love simplicity. It's just like now. a plain white tee and it's just plain white tee or something like that and like people pay hundreds for it okay. <laughs> like they don't like who is it Virgil Abhol I think I don't even know how to pronounce his name but the CEO of it like he's making bank just putting quotation marks on words <laughs> selling them for hundreds of dollars it's, it's yeah. next level look man it's cause it's inspirational okay what the fuck I'm is it inspirational <laughs> shoe. quote shoe quote KFC it's only shoe it's cause it's like a hundred dollars <laughs> People can say I'm wearing a hundred dollar shirt. Yeah, I just, I, I just never, I never understand that stuff. Oh, really? I'd never pay yeah, that much for a shirt. shirt. Even if I was rich. Like, I okay, some, like, some luxury streetwear looks nice. I, I will, like, I would pay hundreds of dollars for like some nice luxury streetwear, but not something that like is so low effort as like off white or the something own? like that. Yeah. Like that, that is just. Yeah, no, I agree. It just sucks. I remember okay, the last wait, day okay, of we're like. Getting uh, off topic. Hold on, 
the last day of high school, I did wear the off-white shirt, though. The fake one. I remember that, yeah. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> I was going to say, didn't, you, didn't everybody... you, like, not know it was fake or something? I remember you saying well, that. Well, I like, didn't know it was it off-white in the first place. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. So people were like, oh, Ron, looking good. And I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> maybe it's the last day of school type of thing. But then <laughs> I look at my shirt and it says off Wheaty. <laughs> like, oh, shit. <laughs> so, one, everybody thinks I'm flexing on them. And two, it's fake. Right? <laughs> That's not even real. Oh, man, it was so bad. All right, let's go back to food. Okay. Well, yeah, <laughs> that was a bit, we kind of went on a tangent there. It's yeah. five guys. We got five guys now. We do got five guys. S tier. It's like an S tier. Mm. It's too it's damn expensive. I have no clue. I put I put it C because of Yo. the price. It's okay. So good, I mean, but like, but like their serving sizes are like their fries. You get they just dump fries in the bag after they fill up the. I know it's so nice. I've never. But don't you? But don't yeah. you not get and fries then, with the burger though? Like, and it's not like they're. Burgers are small either. They like if you get like all the way or whatever they call it, like the full on stack burger, you can go a whole day and just eat that and you'd be set the entire day. You would not get hungry. You can eat like a quarter of it in like an hour? Save it for later. Huh? <laughs> you can like cut it in the four pieces and <laughs> you can even do that. <laughs> no, it's like it's I feel like it's worth the price just because of the size yeah, so and the too. amount they give you. And also, it's very customizable. There's like 250,000 yeah, exactly. ways to do your burger. It's worth it, I think. Oh, wait, wait, wait you really? Mean by that? Uh, Can't yeah, you do I, that? I haven't been to Five Guys in Oh, like no, combinations. Years, so like, you can get like a burger with like ketchup or a burger with ketchup and mustard. That's not like a special yeah, thing, exactly. though, I feel like. I feel like you can do that anywhere. <laughs> it's kind of a special thing. You're, I mean, you can, you can no, but they have it on their menu. How is that 250,000 combinations if it's just ketchup and mustard? Like, at Five Guys, you have a plain, like, cheeseburger or something, and then they ask you what you want on it. While, like, mm -hmm. if you go to, like, McDonald's, they have the set ingredients, and you can't add anything else. Ask. Well, at Five Guys, they have, like, special things. Yeah, you can ask, but these guys don't have they to ask. It's, like, on a menu. Yeah, yeah exactly. They ask for you. But you, you can, though. Like, like if you go to McDonald's and you go, yo, I want... No pickles on my fr or no pickle on my burgers. <laughs> That's large. Fifty percent of the time, they're gonna mess that up. But if you go to Five Guys, <laughs> you know they got the exact, like they know they have to follow the ingredients and they do it. So what I they... feel like it's worth the price. Yeah, I've it's... never. I've had times where they screwed up my order at Five Guys. Yeah, really? I've yeah. never had that happen. Ooh. I've never. I've, I don't. I don't get what. I don't really get what you're trying to say. <laughs> yeah, like David's Five David's Guys told, like, like they have two. Like a thousand different combinations. It's just like yeah, you can I you have two buns with nothing on it, bars. two buns with two holding mustard with a burger in between it, or two yeah, like, It's just like the, <laughs> one slice. You of probably say the same thing about every one hundred fifty thousand ways is different than a well, thousand. Well, it's different. Though. No. <laughs> like it's more but customizable. It's different. <laughs> yo, yo, Lars. McDonald's how, has the menus you where you can like order yourself think, and add the stuff. No, McDonald's yeah, at the kioskies. Things like in Ron it. Says. They have things in it. Like it's not like it comes plain, and then you put stuff in it. They have you set ingredients in it, else, which makes Five Guys more customizable because they start with a plain and you put ingredients in it. What's so hard to understand? You guys are, what? What, what makes just, it so? Like, <laughs> it's a clean slate. Though. Five like, Guys is a clean slate. <laughs> You guys are saying like they're the same thing. Five Guys is a clean slate where you put is stuff like... in. While McDonald's has, you know, they got their special sauce and stuff like, and like their pickles and stuff already in the burger. Just tell me. And to then take you it decide out. whether you want to take it out. We but you can't. Yeah, but you, they don't ask you. Are you saying you put it's it in like yourself? Oh, man. Like, like, or. Are... What? Are you stupid? Have you never been to a Five Guys? Yeah, because it's like ten dollars for a burger. I have never even... been to Five Guys. Here. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I've been there once. God. Yo, the truth comes out. Yo, you guys just don't understand quality. <laughs> you act like this is the biggest like, deal in the world. It tastes so good. It no, it tastes so like, much better than McDonald's. There's like 25 like, different condiments and ingredients you can put into a Five Guy burger. McDonald's, you only have like five, and they're already pre-put in there. It's All like go off, you man. got like your pickles, and you got your like mustard, <laughs> and you got your like ketchup. You got like the pre-ingredients already in there. 
you can't add new ingredients in there. You can only take stuff out. Yeah, you can. But five guys, you got like you twenty-five stuff different types. But it costs more to add in like Big Mac sauce into your. Yeah, it costs more to add sauce. stuff yeah. to a Five Guys burger. Not really. Yeah, but there's like, like twenty-five different ingredients. <laughs> Are you gonna be like, putting twenty-five different right. things on your burger at one time? <laughs> Oh good. No, but you have the option to. What do you guys? <laughs> well, if you're never gonna do it, why does it matter? Oh man. <laughs> what, what if one day you're feeling frisky and you want to put 25 ingredients? All in right, then you're paying like 40 dollars <laughs> for a hamburger. Like, <laughs> yeah, right, that's a point though. Oh, frisky. What? It's. What do you mean? It's literally if you go, you can literally add in unlimited ingredients. You can add all 25, and it's the same price as adding nothing. It's the same price. It's the same price as adding nothing. I don't. I don't. I don't believe. Well, that McDonald's got to pay more. Why would they? What? So you can add. Well, you can add everything. For it's no a, extra cost. Yes, like, no extra cost. Okay, I'm looking at the bad. toppings. Right? It's legitimately just a clean uh, slate. The only different things are um, grilled onions, grilled mushrooms, relish, uh, or peppers, jalapeno peppers, and. Um, Hot sauce and A1 sauce, and that's that's five different yeah. things. That's still that's what? different from twenty five different five, things. Six, 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 twenty five. Five oh, no. times four. Wait, how do you do the math, David? How many different? Is it like five factors? Oh, how you calculate how many? But, okay, the, 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 the amount of okay, different but combinations. There's, there's some like redundant waters, right? Like, like there's grilled onions and regular. Onions, okay, what? Right? Oh, you know what? You know what? Let's just move on to a different one. I'm getting heated. Like, <laughs> oh, like God dang. You guys are stupid. I don't understand how you guys don't understand. Wait, wait, wait. What, what tier did you here. put it in? What tier did you put it in? I put it... I put... Oh, I don't even remember. I put it in a... Uh, what What are we talking about again? <laughs> the tier. Five tier. What? You're Five guys. Oh. Okay, a, I put, I put it, it in, in an A tier. <laughs> Why are you... <laughs> what we're talking about again. Oh man. What? After spending 10 minutes. Well, five guys yeah, with it is 250k list. according to their Twitter. But I don't know. All right. Okay, what's the next one? Let's move Chipotle on. Chipotle S tier. Chipotle <laughs> S tier. That's, that's, that's an automatic S tier. But Chipotle A. Chipotle? Chipotle A. Never had Wait, let me pull up my camera. They used to be Chipotle. They used to be S tier for me, but then they bumped up their prices and they started charging for the extra tortillas on the side, but now they're A tier. Fuck them. Why the world would you get extra day? tortillas on the sides? Huh? Wait, wait, do you get like burritos or do you get bowls? I get like the, the bowl salad? and then I make my own burrito. With the burrito. Oh, bowl. you're one of those people? Oh. Yes, I'm one of those people. <laughs> Damn, I get so much more man. value with that. Man. He's that you guy. You don't understand. Oh yeah, I don't even God. do that. Yeah, fuck you You're wasting your money, dude. It costs the same for a burrito. That's the same for a burrito bowl. No. You get, yeah, okay. Like, two Chipotle has so many different so options. You can get a healthy option or like a like a yo. I want like a cheat meal option. That's mm -hmm. why I put it in the next tier. And they're good. Their quality is just next level. They're pretty good, yeah. I don't get why people go to like fast food places for healthy stuff. Yeah, I never right. get that. It doesn't make sense. I think it's a you convenience know? thing. They don't well, like need, for okay. Themselves. And they yeah. want to be okay. Well, they're not healthy, healthy though. Like, they're just like healthier than other fast food alternatives. That's I mean, how I like, think of it. McDonald's have salads and things. I don't know. Yeah, but, but imagine going to McDonald's, McDonald's for a salad. <laughs> 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 it's, just, it's still lettuce. It's the same. Like, imagine, imagine that, that stuff. <laughs> I'm trying to be healthy. Let me go to McDonald's <laughs> well, for salad. Yeah, let me go. Because we didn't want to go you all the way to the store to buy like salad yeah, stuff. I think it's just like they no, don't spend the time. You can get you can hurry. get romaine lettuce for literally like the price of a salad from McDonald's, and then just add your own like vinaigrettes yeah. or something in your set. Like, and you have like yeah. four like, meals. McDonald's isn't like far more convenient than your local grocery store. Like, it's maybe like a one. Well, yeah, exactly. get out of your car. Yeah. You, you no, understand. it might even be better because you don't have to wait as long. Yeah, yeah but yes, the thing is, like, people do it because they don't want to cook for themselves, right? They don't want to make cooking something. is they just so much. Okay, you literally just have to toss a salad. You just toss some lettuce in there, think... what, whatever, whatever condiment you want, and then but you like, just cook what if it comes it? with chicken, man? You gotta spend you gotta spend the time There's cooking like... the chicken yeah. versus. Who would put? Okay. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> I'm <laughs> You don't have putting salad. I I I just I just put right like I put 
my go-to salad is just romaine lettuce, cucumbers, um, and then sometimes tomatoes in there. That's literally my salad. And then I put some uh, some Korean sauce that I make and I just like dab it in there and that's literally all I put. I don't put meat in my salads. Are you treating that salad like a meal or is that like a side dish? It's a meal. Hmm. Some people and like it's to, really good. Some people like to put in chicken because it just gives it more. No, yeah, I understand that, but like, says if you're trying to go healthy, then I'd rather just go just the salad. Chicken Maybe thigh even advocate. add some like. I'm pretty sure grocery stores also sell like salad containers, right? Or like pre-made salads, stuff like that. They have salad yeah. bars. Like if you go to like. Like even stores, my dad, like he he doesn't really like going through the process of making salads all the time and stuff. So he just gets like the bagged salad, and that's totally fine. Like, it's the same stuff. Yeah, and it's so much yeah. easier. And then shopping is like a really cool experience. You just get to like look at food and like see like what you can make with that stuff, and like it's it's yeah. so much fun. Some people don't like shopping. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Like, I, uh, I, I, I really love shopping. Shopping yeah. is the best. Let's get to the next one. Okay. All right. Here we go. Chick Fil A. Chick Fil A. Oh, this is this is the one. Right. That's an S tier. S tier. It's not it's an a, S tier. That's my second I, S tier. That's my second S tier. There's a moral a dilemma too. I've never had Chick Fil A. The CEO is a uh, homophobic, and transphobic. Yeah, he's, oh. that's true. <laughs> he's a he's a yeah. But they're if we're just talking about their food, bro, it's yeah, it's S tier. It. This uh, is what yeah. I mean. They're chicken nuggets. They're chicken nuggets. Or I've never there. I've never had Wendy's, so I can't attest to that. But their chicken nuggets like ten times better than McDonald's, and stuff. I've, their chicken itself is just better than a lot of other I've chicken. I've heard their options. chicken nuggets are just cut up tenders, and they're called like chicken bites. They're not like yeah. nuggets. They're still better than but it's all the other nugget. nuggets I've had. I'd rather have those nuggets than. The chicken the nugget shape. They're so shaped like nuggets. Yo, Lars, why are you acting like a freaking nugget connoisseur I, I, here? Like, I am. Maybe he is. I that's am. right. <laughs> what what do you do you mean? There's, there's, uh, there's a. Uh, you okay? No. You've had Wendy's nuggets. You've had McDonald's nuggets, and you had Chick Fil A nuggets. What other types of nuggets have you had? Um, I've had like the Burger King ones. Okay, that's four. That's like I don't think that makes sense. I'm not start. saying it's an. I'm, an, Dino I'm just saying get it lunch there's room? a distinction between or nuggets, you know. Yeah, but okay, that's but why Chick Fil A's nuggets are the best. I I've never had them. Where would so you rank know, but... Chick Fil A? If you've never had them, how can you? <laughs> how can, oh, same to you though. How can you Wendy's? say that? <laughs> oh man. Well, no, that's why that's I said I I didn't argue with you about. Your ranking, I just said, why would you go to a, a fast food place just to get chicken nuggets? I never talked to you. No, I'm, I never. I know. I was just mentioning uh, like how their nuggets are at, because like that's just what I've heard, just like what the nuggets are. Aren't they like just cut up tenders? I mean, I don't even know, but they're good. Wait, I mean, man, they sell man. them as nuggets. What do you think about the chicken burger though? It's good. It's, nah. I love their spicy chicken mm. burger. There's I the had it. I love it's, just, burger. it's not that good. It's a B. What it's do you like, guys prefer, uh, Chick Fil A okay. or Popeyes? Popeyes for burger? sure. I've only it's I've only been to Chick Fil A one time, and that was to get the chicken Chick -fil -A. sandwich. And I've never even been to Popeyes. Popeyes chicken sandwich Popeyes. Popeyes. is so much fun. Okay. Because <laughs> I've never their been waffle to fries too. I've their waffle fries too are so good. Okay, I agree with you on those. Those are pretty good. I like those. Yeah, their waffle and um. The only slight I have against Chick Fil A is, believe it or not, is the Chick Fil A sauce. I just, I, I kind of have a, 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 it just, it tastes good, but I can only get through like, like two dips and then I get tired of it. Yeah, that's the it, only it, thing I have right, like yeah. slightly against the sauce. But like all the meals that they have in the menu items, it's just S tier. Mm, nah. I just don't think the burgers are that good. <laughs> I'll be honest. I had the chicken burger. Nah. Really? I, I love it. It's their not burgers. that good. It was so good. It felt so dry, dude. Yes. It was like, yes. It Precisely. It was not that good. Ooh. It was just like. Man, <laughs> wait, for real? Yeah. No, their chickens are juicy. No. No. It was dude. so dry. Especially compared to Popeyes, dude. Popeyes like, the so only much reason it's not no, like I, a C Popeyes is juicy. It's because of the waffle so fries. The waffle fries, like, dude, bring I, it up I a lot. I love chicken. Yeah. Chick-fil-A is good. 
but okay, next. Let's go to the next one. Burger King. Yeah, let's just move. C tier. C. F tier. F tier. I put mine a B. I put an F. I put a solid C there. I put a B too. Burger King is F. What you guys mean? Burger King is worse than McDonald's. It's better than people think it is. It is worse than McDonald's. They're all right. I think they're okay. But it's not F. I mean, F tier is like I wouldn't eat there. I think I would, yeah. they season their patties I, well. Never. It's just dry Yeah, as they're fuck. bland. They're very bland and dry. And they're always burnt. Their too. french fries are trash. Their chicken sandwich is pretty good. I kind of like, like their french fries. Yeah, their french fries. Their chicken sandwiches are really good. It's like the one thing that's kind of expensive. Why would you go to I think they got bought out by Popeyes or something. Or they bought Popeyes ownership or something. So they got the recipe and they kind of copied it or something. That's like a rumor. Oh, really? Yeah. Wait, that's kind of cool. So, like, yeah. I, they really improved it. I didn't know it. that. Wow. I haven't had one of their chicken Everything sandwiches in a long time. I'll have so. to try it again because last time I had it was a yeah. long time ago. I well, was not impressed. It's like, no. I think there's different versions. There's like an ultimate one and then like a, just like a McChicken equivalent, you know, just like the kind of lackluster one. They have the chicken, oh. what they call it. Yeah. I don't know. It's like one of the more recent ones Yo, that came out. Chicken. Chicken. Have you guys seen those ads where it's like, they're like actually marketing it now and they're like, wait, the chicken's better than the burgers? This is impossible. Have you seen those ads? Really? Yeah, there's ads no. like that. That'd be no. a, what's a, what a weird ad to make. I know. <laughs> our burgers kind of suck, but our chicken's actually pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty much what they're saying in that <laughs> yeah. ad. Yeah. Come try it out. Yeah. <laughs> that's pretty good. All right, next one. Let's go Jack in a Box. D tier. A. Yo. Hey, I love Jack in a Box. That's a D tier for me. Love Jack in a Box. It's a D tier. It's not even that bad. It's just the people there just bring down the taste of the food the people yeah, dude, yes because they, they don't clean shit <laughs> they just watch the fucking food burn on the yeah. grill and they're like oh let's just scrape well, it like onto the food the itself side. if it was made you know well it tastes it tastes fine but like the people in it and the people who go there to buy this stuff they just bring down the experience so much that i would never go there again I like their fried food, but then, like I see how they never change the oil. I'm like, okay, I, I remember it happened. Yeah, you worked there, didn't you? Yeah, I've never seen the change of oil once. It's disgusting. <laughs> well, <laughs> it adds the flavor. It's, right? different shit. <laughs> That's true. it's black. <laughs> it's literally like so dark. I can't even see anything. Uh, I'm like, isn't oil supposed to be like brown or like tan? But no, it's. Glass it's so bad. It's disgusting. Come you on. ever have like the mini tacos though? No. Like yeah, those aren't even right. like the it's not even tacos? chicken in there. It's yeah. like, it's just paste. <laughs> it's just like some weird flavored <laughs> chicken, but it's not. Ah, oh, dude, it's so bad. It's I remember awful. I saw that on the mini. I'm like, that looks gimmicky as hell. <laughs> like it just like. It's so like bad. nuggets but tacos. Nah. That like brings That's probably what they are. For me. The grand no. like, round of nuggets. Yeah. For the next. I don't know. I'm a fan. I'm a fan of Jack the Box. I like a lot of their stuff. There's only one thing they I like their their curly like fries. I love. Meal. A lot of their burgers. I like their chicken. I like their like. Oh yeah, the their curly fries are stuff good. that they have. That is true. That stuff's pretty Not good too. Not the tacos. Uh -huh. No, the tacos are ass. The tacos aren't good. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Tacos are but, but I'm a taco hater. The uh, but like I just, I just like a lot of their stuff. Like the mini churros too. There's their milkshakes and stuff. I'm a, I'm. A, their I, milkshakes. Okay. Yeah, the milkshakes are all. No, well, we yeah, I mean they're yeah, not like the best. No, you definitely like, go to other places. Like I better. said, like, like the food isn't bad. Like Ryan's talking about, it's just the experience when you go in. It's just gross. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. that's what low. Ver that's what put it in D tier. It's not the food itself. It's the yeah. experience. I remember I was watching like a fast food tier list video or something, and someone put like Jack in the Box in A tier strictly for their like breakfast menu, oh, and no. so I went. It's Jack in the Box, like for breakfast, and it was pretty bad. And so that really like tainted my experience, you know. I don't know. I, I like the huh. breakfast too. In fact, that they serve it all day. I didn't even know they had breakfast. All so. day breakfast too. Okay. Pretty good deal. Dang. Okay. Right, Wait, what's next, that? Ron? What did I cut out? Wait, okay, yo, yo, yo. Yeah. So I said pretty good. Yo, deal. I want to talk about. Oh, yeah, yeah. I want to talk about In-N-Out. In-N-Out. Let's go to In-N-Out. It's because okay. I you feel like go we're to right. running a little out of time. We are running so a little out of time. Alright, let's hit In-N-Out. What's I our take on it? Mm. 
S plus. S is not S plus. I looked at their prices. I, I'll put it above. They're really cheap. Every. Fast it's a B tier. Yo, did you say I B drove B eight B. hours no, just B. to get in and out. Beer, beer A. What the hell, man? It's overhyped. Like, I drove. It's overhyped. I literally Min is drove just that. So Min yeah, is the guy honestly, who gets overhyped like, about it, it. No, in and out is literally the best fast food joint ever. Like. No, I, I, like I said, <laughs> no, it's not. I will literally, like I will literally go on a road trip Jesus. just for In and Out. Like it's, like their fries, best fries I've had ever. Like their fries are next level, better than McDonald's, better than Chick Fil A. Their burgers, cheap. You and if you get them with the onions, they're so good. I mean, they're S plus. I would, I will literally eat. I could literally eat them every day. That's the only fast food place that I actually crave. Everything else is like. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. It's good, but it's overhyped. No, it is not the best. No, it's not even overhyped. It's so good. It just tastes. I don't know what you guys are on. It just tastes the same. It's for me. It tastes like Dicks, In and Out, Dicks, Five Guys, and like Burger Master. They all taste like. No, you Like they just put they just put a shit ton of cheese on their burgers, and it tastes really good because they have a shit ton of cheese. But it's like it's like okay. It's not like. It's not amazing. It's like the same as Dicks. Which it's. Yeah. Yeah. No, exactly. It's so it's much better than same. Dicks. Dicks. I think Dicks is way cheaper. But Dicks too, right? is cheaper. But don't so. you get yeah, more? Right. No, but it's know? so much better. Go like the price, because aren't like Dicks yes. burgers pretty small? Literally, you can eat them in like two know. bites. Or Nathan could eat them in two bites. It's like <laughs> okay. five. Well, that's not I've... saying much though. It's Nathan. <laughs> <I've>... like... <laughs> you could eat everything in two bites. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I've never had in and out burgers. No, but. Like or like a like an authentic one, They're but ten times better than. Take your favorite burger. Wait, how do you have fast an food Multiply that by well, ten. Well, like I haven't had like just like I think I've had like, like the plain cheeseburger equivalent. Man. No. Like, oh, so yeah. you went to Yo, you, and yeah, just had the like plain that. cheeseburger. So it's, how do we all win but, at one point? Yeah, but yeah, what yeah, I was gonna right. say was, I was gonna put it at an A because I didn't think it was that good. But then I, like I thought about the price. Like I was just looking at menu prices and stuff. And that's why I made it an S. It's just because, like, this is this is an example Dude. of what Five Guys could be. That's all I'll say. That's all I'll what say. you? Okay. <laughs> oh, no. In and Out is just next up. Even their milkshakes are the best milkshakes I've had. Like, never had one. I don't know yeah, where. I haven't had them. I've only been well, there one time. Like, to be I've, fair, I, but, no. I've been there like, like the nearest one is eight hours away, and I've been to that one like four times in the past like two years. Which is what? That's like 16, that's 32 hours, that's 32 hours committed just to get in and out. I mean, that's the only reason you I went, feel like, was just to get in and out? And the beach, hmm. but. Okay. Because that's Oregon has some nice beaches. That's fair enough. But, hmm. uh, you know, I went, like, the beach was like an hour away from there, and I would rather go to, like, I would go to in and out because it's that good. Wow. Like, in and outs just, it's just the next level when it comes to, like, fast food. Man, I, could, I wouldn't consider guy. it a fast food. He yeah. really, really sounds like Cali he lives guy. there. <laughs> no, I, 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 I dislike California, though. I would never <laughs> live there. <laughs> but I would live there for in and out <laughs> That's the only thing. Okay, so that's going to wrap up the episode for today. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we didn't get to talk about my favorite, my S tier. I put one thing S tier. Oh, what's your S tier? I just put, yeah, we can here, just really quick go by it, but I put Dairy Queen as my S tier. Really? I oh, love that's my F tier. Really? I love Dairy Queen. <laughs> really? I, I love Dairy Queen. I have it in my F. Dude, it's so Let's good. Hear this. I love I... everything there. Everything there I love. Really? Like the burgers, the really? chicken. I, I love their chicken. Yeah. They they're... have these things called like cheese curds. Those are so good. Like, and their their blizzards are the best. They're just the best. Of, like all the fast food, like milkshakes and stuff. Their fries are really good. The blizzards uh, are good. Come. I've never been there. Everything there, Sad I love everything insane. there. They're I could order really, anything off the menu and I consider it. I consider an F tier, but like <laughs> I've only had like a few of their menus. I think options. Dairy Queen's fries are probably some of the best fries in like fast food. They're really they're, good, yeah. They're pretty good. Really? Really? But I think I think the I've thing I, the fries. I don't get I've them because I think they have really small portion size for it. But I'm so fucking hungry. Their, their man. fries are like, yeah. like, like really light, like, oh, fluffy. It's nice. But their I'm cheese curds. So you place the cheese curds with the fries. So fucking good. Mm. I just love it. I just love that place. 
I'm gonna have to go to Dairy Queen after this. I'll be an E, bro. And they're blizzards. Yo, <laughs> yeah. Dairy Queen, they're blizzards. <laughs> best. Like, it goes without but saying, you know? Yeah. The blizzards are. Dude, the too. summer ones, dude. Oh my god, the cotton candy ones. They have an animal crap, like animal cookie one too. They have like a like, chocolate strawberry. Oh one. my god, it's so good. good. So damn good. Yeah. <laughs> All right, everybody. Thanks for watching the episode, episode two. We're on Spotify, Apple Music. We're on Amazon Music, iTunes, Apple Podcasts. We're everywhere. We're going to get a YouTube channel going up too, Instagram. We're going to be worldwide. But <laughs> Well, I think that's, that's, that's kind of... That's kind worldwide. of... That's a little ambitious. <laughs> Overestimating there. Okay, worldwide with our 40 downloads. But anyway, thanks for watching. See you guys next episode. Bye. 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 All right. <laughs> <laughs>